this can't be right. Joe, I've got this email saying you've signed us up for a 5k run. That's got to be spam, right? It might be fun. But you never run. Are you serious, Joe? This year, Exercise has joined Alcohol on our van life adventures. Paddleboarding, cycling, and now running. Joe and running have never really been a combination that works. Joe has issues with her joints, and this affects her confidence and self-belief in what she might be capable of. I tried coach to 5k before. Didn't end well for my ankle. Time for take two. After um, a month of cycling, now got a coach to 5k in two weeks before I run the JLR 5k at Yeah. Let's see how this goes, eh? If Joel can get through this challenge without any injuries, this could be a game changer for her confidence. The Coach to 5K training is designed to increase fitness and build stamina at a pace that can be achieved by anyone. Accelerating the program to achieve my goal, I've condensed the 27 run schedule down to 11, but following the timeline of extending running time at each session. And I will be trying to video this journey. Our local park is a great place to start. A five minute warm up walk, followed by 60 seconds of running and 90 seconds of walking. Seven times. That's seven minutes of running on day one. I'm off the couch. This is turning out to be tougher than I thought. First run done, how do you feel? Feel all right, not too bad. Knees all right? Yeah, them are good. There are many Couch to 5K apps out there to help you along the way. Jo has chosen this one and motivating her for each session is radio DJ Jo Wiley. The route from Couch to 5K is normally spread over nine weeks with three runs per week. Jo has just two weeks before the event, so she is tailoring her schedule to suit. If you are thinking of doing a couch to 5k, try and take the full nine weeks, including all the rest days. With no rest day, I'm upping my run to 90 seconds, followed by a two minute recovery walk, five times. That's seven and a half minutes of running on day two. Well, I learnt my lesson after day one of recording. Day two. I'm on my bike. Adding a few stretches on day three. Seven and a half minutes of running time again. Jo has been using biofreeze on her knees and any other aching areas after each run. This offers some well needed soothing. Family out into Canet Chase provides an opportunity for a more scenic run. The runs are now getting longer, enjoying my surroundings. I realised I was also enjoying running. A 
After a busy couple of days, including my first rest day, I did my first street run. It can't always be sunshine and park runs, but my schedule was tight. I was running when I could. It was getting dark, but you can run just outside your front door, so you have to take the opportunities when they're available. Another late run in the park, I wanted to avoid the rain. I'm a fair weather runner. With only a week to go before the event, I'm now pushing myself to do longer runs. I have a couple of recovery days planned for week two. Round the block, my block. I used to run this route when I was too young to cross the road. It helps knowing that you don't have to go far outside your own front door to get off the couch. A few laps of the block are all you need, even if some of it is uphill. Done 16 minutes of running today, halfway in days, halfway in running time, and halfway in distance. As the weekend arrived, so did our van life. After a night in our van, Phoebe, we arrived in Foley for Joe's first beach run. Foley is a small fishing village on the Yorkshire coast and we have holidayed here for 25 years. Running on the beach was a real surprise. Headphones in and beautiful scenery. Running isn't a chore. This was definitely my favourite one so far and something I could see myself doing more of on our van life adventures. My planned run was three times five minute runs, but again, I ran the extra five minutes before my warm down walk, which conveniently just happened to leave me here. If you ever want to try the best fish and chips in all of the land, then England is the place for you. You definitely deserve these. With the weekend over, it was back to routine. And the first run straight from work. With no surroundings, wildlife and a good towpath, I managed to run for 25 minutes, split by a recovery walk right in the middle.
dating. I was feeling confident and was going for my first 25 minute non-stop run. We headed to water again, although the terrain was really unpredictable. I can't go through there, surely. That way. The uneven ground wasn't great for my knees or the low hanging benches. I'll be checking out my roof in the future. This was my longest run and filled me with hope for the weekend as although my knees felt a little sore, the run itself went out okay. Apparently I even worked up a sweat. A local park for my final training run. A 28 minute run, although I continued until I'd reached the 3.1 miles. Oh, it's not so bad. I didn't realise I was training for this 5k. But, fuck I am. in 44 minutes 3.12 sorry two weeks of training completed and no injuries it was now time for the JLR great 5k The event at Jaguar Land Rover's Proving Ground was organised in remembrance to all JLR employees who have lost their lives due to COVID-19. With over 400 runners taking part, it was great to be a part of something special. It made all the hard work and training worthwhile. Get around this track as fast as you possibly can. So we're going to do 10 minutes just to get you prepared. My name's Tommy, I'm from BMF. We are the largest outdoor fitness company in the UK. Joe was singing again, which meant she was in a happy place. 
and this guy even said he was joining us for the entertainment. We were motivated by many people all the way around and it was nice to be motivating others. You happy with that? Yeah. 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 It was an emotional day because of the circumstances. And also, I haven't run since childhood. And I'd have never believed I could run 5k. <laughs> That's good. He's not bad, just considering I didn't run till two weeks ago. That's brilliant. Two weeks. That's something that, from two weeks. I'm really pleased. That. Brilliant. Oh, so we're going to beat that next year now. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> or next Saturday. I'll be keeping up running as it's been fun. And I do feel fitter. And I never thought I would say that. If you were thinking of giving it a try, just go for it. If I can do it, then you can too. I hope you've enjoyed my journey. Thanks for watching. Yeah, it's not a photo. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know? Oh. It might be fun. Sorry, I wasn't expecting the big eyes. <laughs> <laughs>